Are you ready for some awesome free FPS games that will blow your mind? Do you want to shoot, blast, and snipe your way to victory without spending a single cent? Well, you're in luck, because today, I'm going to show you the 10 best free shooter games on Steam that you need to check out. Trust me, these games are so good, you'll be hooked in no time. So first one is Banana Shooter. Banana Shooter is a fun and addictive multiplayer shooter game that will keep you entertained for hours. The game is simple. You are Dave, a banana lover who has to fight other Daves for the precious fruit. You can customize your weapons, upgrade your skills, and use various mechanics such as dash, double jump, grapple hook, and rocket jump to gain an edge over your opponents. The game has multiple maps, each with its own challenges and secrets. The graphics are colorful and cartoonish, the sound effects are hilarious, and the game Gameplay is fast and smooth. Banana Shooter is a free-to-play game that offers a lot of content and replay value. If you are looking for a casual and enjoyable shooter game, you should definitely give Banana Shooter a try. You will not regret it. Second game is Fistful of Frags. Fistful of Frags is a multiplayer shooter set in the Wild West. It offers a variety of game modes, weapons, and maps to suit different playstyles and preferences. Whether you prefer to duel with pistols, snipe with rifles, or blast with shotguns, you will find something to enjoy in this game. The game has a unique star system that balances the loadout options and perks for each player. You can choose to wield powerful but slow weapons, or faster but weaker ones, or mix and match to create your own combination. You can also spend stars on perks such as dynamite, throwing knives, or brass knuckles to spice up your gameplay. The game has a distinct western atmosphere and aesthetic with authentic sound effects, voice lines, and music. The maps are well designed and varied, ranging from dusty towns to snowy mountains to steam trains. The graphics are not the most impressive, but they are still decent and fit the theme. The third one is The Rifleman. This game is a fun, fast-paced, and challenging first-person shooter that takes you back to the classic World War or two era. The game has a lot of variety and customization options, from different game modes and types, to weapon and character skins. The graphics are low poly but still colorful and appealing, and the sound effects are realistic and immersive. Game requires skill and accuracy to survive. The bolt-action rifles are the main weapons in the game, and they are very satisfying to use. The headshots are instant kills, and the supply drops can give you an edge with more powerful weapons or melee weapons. This game is very competitive and rewarding, as you can level up up your character and unlock new items. The next game is Blockade. Blockade is a game that combines creativity, action, and strategy in a fun and immersive way. The game allows you to customize your own cubic world, where you can build, destroy, and explore with up to 32 players on one map. You can choose from a variety of game modes, such as Team Deathmatch, Capture the Flag, Zombie Survival, and more. The game also features a large arsenal of weapons, ranging from pistols and rifles to rocket launchers and grenades. One of the best aspects of Blockade is the ability to create create and modify your own world. You can use different blocks and tools to build your own base, fort, or castle. You can also destroy the environment and use it to your advantage. For example, you can create tunnels, bridges, or traps to ambush your enemies. You can also use the environment to hide, snipe, or flank your opponents. The game gives you a lot of freedom and creativity to shape your own experience. The fifth game is Cryptus. This game will challenge your skills, your wits, and your nerves as you explore a dark and mysterious realm filled with undead horrors. The game is a homage to the classic FPS games of the 90s. Cryptus is not a game for the faint of heart, as you will face relentless enemies that will test your reflexes and your ammo supply. You will need to use your movement abilities, such as dashing and jumping, to navigate the complex and varied environments and to gain an advantage over your foes. You will also need to use your logic and deduction skills as the game features a clever and intriguing story that will keep you guessing until the end. Cryptus is a game that rewards exploration, experimentation, and curiosity as you will discover secrets, easter eggs, and hidden clues that will enrich your gameplay and reveal more about the cryptic world you are in. Cryptus is a game that will appeal to fans of both old-school and new-school FPS games as it offers a perfect balance of nostalgia and innovation. The sixth game is Killfish. Killfish is a game that will hook you from the start. It is a FPS game that takes you to a world where robots have taken over a factory. You have to use your hook and your weapons to fight your way through the levels and kill the enemies. The gameplay is challenging and fun, with a unique hook mechanic that gives you a lot of freedom and mobility. You can use the hook to swing, pull, or launch yourself across the levels, as well as to grab or throw objects and enemies. The hook adds a lot of variety and strategy 
strategy to the game, as you can use it to avoid obstacles, reach hidden areas, or kill enemies in flashy ways. The game also has a style meter that rewards you for killing in stylish ways and lets you buy upgrades for your weapons and abilities. This game have a mysterious and intriguing storyline that keeps you engaged and curious. You play as a man who is trying to escape his past, but finds himself trapped in a loop of repeating the same mistakes. The game has a lot of symbolism and hidden meanings that will make you think and wonder about the true nature of the game's world and your role in it. Next game is Totally Accurate Battlegrounds. This game is a hilarious and chaotic physics-based battle royale. The game is a parody of the popular genre, but it also offers a lot of original and creative features that make it stand out from the crowd. The game lets you customize your character with a variety of outfits, accessories, and hairstyles, and then drop into a fun-sized map with up to 60 other players. You can choose from solo, duo, or squad mode, and team up with your friends or random strangers. The game have over 90 weapons to find and use, ranging from conventional guns and grenades to absurd items like a shallow pot with a long handle, a balloon crossbow, and an inflatable hammer. You can also use physics-based parkour to jump, climb, and slide around the map, or hop into a vehicle and drive recklessly. The eighth game is Red Match 2. Red Match 2 offers a thrilling and fast-paced gameplay experience. The game features grapple hooks, which allow you to swing across the maps and surprise your enemies with your mobility and agility. You you can also upgrade your stats with kills, giving you an edge over your opponents. The game has multiple weapons and game modes to choose from, as well as tons of maps with different themes and layouts. You can also customize your match settings to create your own game modes, such as changing the gravity, weapon damage, player size, speed, jump height, and more. The game has a vibrant and active community, with over 13,000 positive reviews on Steam. The developers are constantly updating the game with new content and features, such as seasonal bundles, skins, and events. Next game is Paint Warfare. This game offers a refreshing and fun experience for casual and hardcore gamers alike. The game features fast-paced action, jetpacks, hang gliders, and a variety of weapons and abilities to choose from. Whether you want to shoot paintballs, spoons, oranges, or gas, you will find something to suit your style and taste. The game has 10 unique maps to explore, each with its own theme and layout. You can fight in the desert, the snow, the jungle, the temple, the factory, and more. The game also has six different game modes to enjoy, such as Free For All, Team Deathmatch, Capture the Flag, Hunger Games, Point Capture, and Custom Games. You can play solo or with your friends, and join matches instantly with no waiting time. And the last game is Dirty Bomb. Dirty Bomb is a team-based, objective-oriented shooter that takes place in a post-apocalyptic London. The game offers fast-paced, adrenaline-pumping action with a variety of characters, weapons, and abilities to choose from. Dirty Bomb is not your typical shooter. It requires strategy, coordination, and skill to complete the missions and defeat the enemy team. Dirty Bomb has a lot of things going for it. The graphics are crisp and detailed, the sound effects are immersive and realistic, and the gameplay is smooth and responsive. The game runs well on most systems, and the servers are stable and lag-free. The game also has a vibrant and friendly community, with regular updates, events, and tournaments to keep the players engaged and entertained. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and found some new games to try out. If you liked this video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more gaming content. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.